Have you ever tried to change the data connection for one of your data sources in Tableau and just everything went to pieces? Well, I'm going to show you how to fix that issue right now. Let's go. Welcome to another Tableau video. And once again, if this is your first time here, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get alerts when I release new videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So let's begin. So this one's a little bit different in that we have to download two data sets so the links are in the description below if you want to follow along and I'm just going to show you what the two data sets are and why this is something you really have to know when you're designing in Tableau right um, I've got the first data set here and this is the first thing we're going to load up Actually, I shouldn't have done that and basically it's just a regular data set cool so what happens in the real world you know in the corporate world when you're designing things for yourself or for other people you know you start off with the data set and you start building cool you start doing formulas and all that kind of stuff and then someone goes hey listen do you need a refresh of that data i'll give it to you again but the second time they give it to you it's slightly different they've changed labels or something like that or the data types or whatever right so what we have to do as the designers we have to bring in the new data and then fix up all the connections that broke down right so the example we're looking at here is i've basically changed this field heading from country to country region and then this one from sales to total sales okay so let's close this up and let's see how we deal with an issue like this so we're going to load up the um, data set replace one first all right cool no problem there we're going to go sheet one and let's build a visualization so i'm going to start by building a country visualization so we'll double click that all right so we've got our countries and i'm going to drop sales into color cool that's basically it okay so one of the other uh, issues that can happen as well is someone accidentally deletes your raw data right so if i go ahead and let's say i delete this one when I try and load this up, it's going to go, well, where's your data set? I've got nothing to, to load up. In that case, you still want to do the same thing, which is reconnecting or reestablishing those connections. So let's say, you know, the new data set comes in or I lost my old one. In any case, we need to replace it. How do I replace this data set replace one with data set replace two and still preserve any visualizations I have, any functions? Let me just do a simple function here. Create calculated field. Let's go sales plus one so i'm going to go sales plus one and go okay and that's just to show that there's going to be a connection so let's go ahead and do that i'm going to load this up so the way we load it up is i can actually just drag and drop it straight away and it'll establish a brand new connection or uh, where's my drawing tool hotkey i can use this button right here and this will let me do the same thing right I'm basically adding a data another data source connection so maybe I'll, I'll just do the drag and drop because I'm super lazy and it's like one in the morning, <laughs> right? So we got data set replace two here. Cool. No worries. And if I go back to sheet one, right, everything's still good because this visualization is still connected to the first one. Okay. So let's say I want to replace one with two. The way I do it is I right click this one. Okay. I'm going to do this very slowly. And we're going to go replace data source. Okay. And then because because we only got two here, Tableau is going to guess, well, you know, if you're replacing one with whatever is there, it's most likely two. If you have more than one connection, then you you can pick which one you're going to replace it with. And you just go OK. And what you'll also notice is when we do this, that little blue symbol, which actually tells you which data source this visualization is using, right, is going to move to this other one. All right, it's going to move to this data set replace two. So just have a look out for that. There you go. Okay, so now we've completely replaced that, which means we can now close off this connection because we're not using it anymore. However, the problem we have is that this country field that it had in the previous data set no longer exists. Instead, it exists as country region, but Tableau doesn't know that. Same thing goes for sales. Sales has been replaced by total sales so we need to not only replace the connection we have to replace the dimensions and the measures with the new ones so how do we do that very simple uh very similar uh si very similar is that right that sounds off um we right click this one all right uh the one with the error and we go replace preferences uh preferences references 
right? And then we simply pick the one we're going to be using, which is going to be this country region. And we go OK. So what that does is it replaces any connections with that setup. All right, so everything gets preserved. This is really neat. It saves you a lot of time. Um, those of you who've worked with Excel spreadsheets before where someone has tweaked something kind of upstream or downstream, whatever they say, and it just ruins everything, this is kind of the same deal, right? So we're going to do it for this one. We're going to go right-click, replace references, and we're going to pick total sales. And we go OK, and our visualization is back online. And that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed, uh, enjoyed, enjoyed. Uh, be sure to hit that like button. It helps a lot with the YouTube algorithm to spread the channel and all that kind of stuff. And again, if you want to learn all things you, uh, Tableau, I have courses in my description below on Udemy. Soon to be releasing, you know, I'm still building, but hoping to release my fully fledged course on my own website one day. Ah, more work, but we're getting there day by day. So anyways, have a good night, guys, and I will see you next time. Bye.